video is going to be for the palpation of the muscle known as subclavius. Subclavius means below clavicle. It is a quite a small muscle and we don't really talk too much about it in a lot of therapy. However, its job basically is to help stabilize this medial end of the clavicle and draw it inferiorly. So sometimes the individual is having difficulty lifting up that clavicle or it rotating as you go through flexion or they've had a trauma or injury to the sternoclavicular joint, sometimes subclavius can be extremely tight. So what I'm gonna do is show you the O and I and a little bit of palpation for it. Its origin is more central, which is on top of the costal cartilage of rib number one. So this being the clavicle here, rolling off and underneath in this area. And its insertion is in the groove for subclavius, which is in the middle on the inferior surface of the clavicle, right as it transitions from convex into concave. So again, to try and get at that, you'd have to have the shoulder relaxed a little bit. So I'm gonna lift up the shoulder slightly and tip my finger to the underside and push back. So this can be a little bit more of a sensitive area for this muscle. Again, it's not something that a lot of people have poked at, but our fiber direction is gonna be running in this direction. So again, I'm going to suck up underneath that clavicle, the pads in my fingers as best I can, and try to do a little bit of palpation back and forth. At the same time, I'm going to ask him gently just to try and pull down his clavicle. Good. And relax. The majority of that's going to happen through pectoralis major. However, you may feel some tension or tightness, especially as you're trying to palpate this muscle all the way along this area. The other thing that you could do is try to bring the arm up through a little bit of flexion. We'll start to roll that clavicle posteriorly and you might be able to suck up underneath that a little bit. So I'm trying to squeeze my fingers to the under surface. One more thing to note is how much mobility there is inside that clavicle. So using a pincher grip, if this clavicle isn't moving at all or it's very, very restricted, there might be a lot of adhesions or tightness inside your subclavius. So again, trying to hook to the underside and doing some palpation might help create a little mobility for this clavicle to move around. That's gonna conclude our palpation of subclavius.